<laughs> Welcome to my laboratory. <laughs> I always did want to do that. I always did want to do that. And it keep, I always did want to do that. And the phone keeps stopping. The camera keeps stopping. So, there you go. Where are we at? What are we doing today? Well, we're official. That's been cleaned with, ME, uh, with um, acetone. See the pile of rags that I do not intend to throw in my trash can? Why do you ask? Because they're not dry. Um, got some resins over there. I uh, got some milled fiber. I got some uh, chopped strand fiber, quarter inch. I got some cabosil and some extra cabosil. I got MEKP. I got my respirator. And I am getting ready. There's the acetone that I used earlier. Got me an extra magnet. Um, this has been shifted up and sanding application or job site or wh whatever you want to, to a fiberglass job. And that's why all this other stuff has been moved up here. I put this little table here, and I got high hopes I don't knock it off in any way, shape, or form. But I feel like I'm in good shape, and I'm getting ready to mix up my very first uh, eight ounce. Let's start with eight ounce. <laughs> Go easy at first. Eight ounce thing of peanut butter. And I'm going to use it to... Uh, glue that piece in and then fill those voids that you see down there and I'm going to start small and go from there and after I get that done all the to cover the stringers and these motor mounts the for the stringers and these got glued on with some PL construction adhesive this got glued in with some uh, marine PL adhesive, not construction. Completely different products. This is three inches to here. And what my plan was to glue it on and weight it down, which I did, until it cures, which is two days ago, so it should be good and cured. We're looking at 80 plus degrees today in the shop. I got my... Uh, uh, little uh, exhaust vent going on what I plan to do is set the motor mounts on top of these and then measure from the motor mount through this into this instead of doing what they did which was countersinking a bunch of screws that were only about that long into it and they all ate up with rust that way, when the motor mount screws will be getting replaced. I was going to lag bolt it down as it cured, and I said, you know what? I want it glued on first. That way I know it's glued to the wood. It's not being pulled by the lag bolts. And then I want the strength of the motor mount bolts to go through this, into this, but not into the hole, obviously. And then the fire waiting on my camera. So when the fiberglass goes over all of it, it'll be from the deck, over the top, down the sides, into the deck, overlapped. So when the motor torques, it will be pulling on all of that, not just two bolts up here and me worrying about pulling this board off of this and that kind of stuff. I think it's a perfect idea i just have to wait until i'm ready to put the motor in before i can get an exact measurement before i go lag bolt shopping but i'm pretty sure that's my plan these right now have just been glued on they're going to be fiberglassed on but there will be screws that go all the way from the motor mount into the bottom board thank you and have a great day